Today's telecast is presented live from this nation's capital, Marine Washington BS. And we're at Insurrection Field for today's game. The stadium is sold out with the rabid fans, while the skyboxes are filled with congressmen, lobbyists, and attorneys. Ho oh, ho, our government at work. Today's matchup is going to be a good one. The teams take the field. The New York Tyrants go up against the Brain Washington Cadavers. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. If you like your cocktail cold, your soup hot, and your steak still mooing, then you're going to love seeing mutants not cold, their brains turn into hot lava soup, and their bodies strewn about the field, lying still and barely moving. NFL game day is on the air. Oh, you just made me hungry, Grim. I'm going to go get some of them extra crispy mutant finger strips. Hey, get me a full slab of broken mutant ribs while you're there. Not much there, maybe a yard. Second down and nine. First and ten. And they just popped his eyes in the back of his head. That quarterback can be hurting, or dead, or worse. Second down and more than the QB would like. Quarterback, you have to take. Oh, he just got crushed. And it's first and ten. left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. And he was stuck to him like glue. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot. And with another pick. Oh, man, talk about running into a buzzsaw, Bricks. Okay, he just ran into a buzzsaw. Does anyone have a rule book? Because that sounds like he's making stuff up. Uh, do we have a rule book? It's propping up your chair so you can reach the table without spilling your food, idiot. Second down the side. It's a jailbreak. And the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Oh, crowd's loving it. First and eight to go. Hot, hot one, hot two, eight. And that's another pick. Man, oh man. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. You can't hear what I got. Yeah, get the hell out of here, man. And 
And it's first and ten. And a hard run there picks up the first down. Yeah, man, I was going to spin him now. You know what happened? <laughs> and it's first and ten. Second down and long. When defensive players go berserk, they've been known to rip the boom and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo grim. Third down and, well, good luck. Hot one, hot two. Hot Leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. I'm not saying the rap has been rhymed, but he drove out of the field in a brand new verse. You should know why I'm back down. When it's gold time, or it's no time, so I'm double cut the curl. Four. The defense had enough with this rep and jumps off sides to kill him. <laughs> and it's first and ten. <laughs> Refuses to go. And that's some good old fashioned downhill running as he picks up nine yards on the play. And that'll bring up second and one. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Well, of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. And that'll bring up third and one. Well, it looks like the coach is ripping that play from the playbook. What a dud. Now, well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, that well, maybe I actually shouldn't discuss this on here. And he's got a chance for a good return here. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot three. Yo, man, nobody can touch you when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Second down and a very lot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. about a three-yard pickup. Oh, mama! Just call him Cap and Crunch. Another one bites the dust.
Third down in. The punter is warming up. Hot one, hot two. Eight. And the quarterback throws it now with the brain scrambler. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> And it's first and ten. Defense and that's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. Second down and nine. Steering a pick six, but dropped the interception. And that's why he's on defense, schmuck. Third down and nine. more to say about this guy except maybe a eulogy. Ah, uh, well, he was a violent alcoholic, a terrible father, and uh, he did some nasty things to dogs. <clears throat> but, uh, I mean, he was a great ball player. Uh, you know, that's really what counts at the end of the day, right? Second down and nine. Oh, with the brain scrambler. Third down and five. The fans are looking a bit bored. After a quarter with no score, they're cheering down the refs. <laughs> At least someone's moving the ball. Third down and five. Ah, another inning. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, win, but my watch is a bit slow. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two. And he gets three yards on that run. Second down and seven. When it's your time to go, it's your time. And it's first and ten. This is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. The 20 could go all the... And yeah, never mind. The offense lost another running back and only two remain on their roster. When a team loses all their running backs, they lose their ability to run the ball. Yeah, like if I rip out your tongue, you won't be able to speak. Tell us something we don't know, genius. And it's first and ten. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. The offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, Wim, they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. Uh, the, the funeral expenses, that is. And that'll be second down and four. And into the end zone for a touchdown! Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races.
No little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. And that kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And it's first and ten. Hey, guys, this isn't funny. I swear to drunk, I'm not God, but seriously, stay in drugs, eat school, and don't do vegetables. Koyata comes up. Good throw, good catch, but not quite good enough at nine yards. And that'll bring up second and one. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. The offense is down to their last running back. When he bites the dust, they can only pass. Yeah, well, at least they don't have to forfeit, Grim. That's right, but now the defense can focus on killing the receivers. And it's first and ten. Oh, man, what a throw. And, Sonic, and then it's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Yeah. Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and it's first and ten. with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, I'm going in circles. <laughs> the offense lost their last running back on the previous play. Next time the offense comes out on the field, they will have no running plays. And it's first and ten. The defender's one feet just kicked, and he's off to the races. He's at the 20, he's at the 10. Holy mother of mutant mayhem, he scored! And that's quite a creative and intuitive dance he's doing. Hey, Grim, what do you call a wolf who was intuitive? I don't know, what? And a werewolf! <laughs> oh, man, I just cracked myself up. And they line up for the extra point. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. First and ten. The receiver runs away from the pass marker. That's a good clue that something's not right. Second down and ten. And he's off to the races. Look at that little. First and ten. And he just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? And that mutant just... 
just about met his maker on that hit. I thought he was made in China. I don't see any Chinese guys down there. You're a fucking moron. And it's first and ten. He picks up a two. And that'll be second and eight to go. Does the QB know which team he's on? I don't even know where I'm at. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. And the defense was all over that fumble. Oh, great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely. The offense lost their final running back. Lucky for them, they're on defense now. They're lucky to survive so much bad luck, carnage, and death, Grim. And it's first and ten. Don't worry. If he shots you to death. At this rate, the QB can he's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. He's at the 40. He's at the 30. The 20. Oh, that was a vicious hit. There might not be an eye in team, but this guy's eyeballs are all over the other team's helmets right now. <laughs> And it's first and ten. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't dip. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the MFL. <laughs> Under two minutes, a timeout means the QB is playing beat the clock, and he better win. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Yeah, same as Brits' ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she called it rabbit sex. I took it as a compliment. And then Cats will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set. A timeout is called by the quarterback. They have one left. And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. And he finds open space, is running toward the end. Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Ouch! Anyone in the mood for steak tartare? Such bullshit. This game is fucking rigged. I tell you, the programmers are speeding up the defense. I'm gonna write an email to that fucker. And it's first and ten. One big mutant sandwich down there. One guy's definitely toast. That's what you call a club sandwich, Grim. And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. Welcome back. Hope you enjoyed the carnage during today's halftime show. Obviously, they need to play a lot harder here in the second half to make a game of it. Or they can start cheating and killing. That's what I'd do. They need a 
good return here to set up the offense. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for You know what? Never mind. It looks like we've got a penalty here. <laughs> the burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Now, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? Now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on a bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. Man, I've had it. I'm running out of it. Oh, did he take a punishing hit? You ever had your lights knocked out like that, Bricks? Yeah, the white juice at the Pool Hooters chicken wings last night? Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, and then the police horse is out front in the stadium earlier. It was just a joke slap, but the horse took it seriously. Not surprised. Come on, man, you can't hang with me. You get my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. You understand me? Second down and more than the QB would like. The quarterback is getting mauled out there. Third down, and the QB is saying his prayers. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. He's running out of gas now. Somebody get that guy a beer, because he just saved me a thousand bucks. The offense is losing quarterbacks faster than teams lose their minds at spring break. They're down to their last QB before they have to forfeit. And it's first and ten. Second down and long. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. They might catch him. Oh, you fat little mutant. He's at the 20, and he runs out of gas and got tackled short of the goal line. Hell of a run, though. Uh, I like the stamina happens to a lot of guys, Grim. Uh, at least that's what I hear. And it's first and ten. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. Off to the races. Oh, so close, but not today. And it's first and ten. And the defense spiked the offensive water with strawberry fields. And now they can taste sound, but can't remember what the concept of time is. Ghost. Ghost. Second down in a very lot. Oh, great play by the defense. The receiver didn't stand a chance. Third down and, well, hot, good luck. Hot one, hot two, three. 
expect the ball to explode, and the defensive player got blown to bits. <laughs> Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play deep. A fake punt. If you can't trust a punter, who can you trust? Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hey! The defender says, I don't think so. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hey! Oh, and did he just put on a display there? here or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room hey. the kick is good as expected those are pretty much just kidneys here comes the kicker oh, i can't wait to hear this what's the kicker grim uh, this guy in the field oh i thought you were gonna tell me a story like here's the kicker when i turned on the light it wasn't a broad in my bed it was a chip wearing a wig And it's first and ten. And he pounds the ball into the defense, picking up seven. The cadavers win by forfeit. Their opponents are now lifeless and dead. Which basically makes it qualified to run for Congress. The entire game was trench warfare. Both teams battling back and forth, bruised and battered, but in the end, there could be only one winner. There are winners in my book. I think that a feeder team should get a participation award because well, I try really hard. Why don't you try real hard to shut the fuck up? Nice mouth. Why don't you try to lay off the scotch, Junior? Suck on it. Real nice. Let's go to the game's MVP. Once again, the folks at Evil SM thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.